The only way you can ever come close to achieving real happiness, fulfillment, success, or significance is by being in the present moment. In any area of your life, if you want to win the moment, you got to be in the moment. And that is much easier said than done. With the bombardment of digital distractions that we face every second of every single day, being in the present moment is for me without question, as a 43-year-old father of three and a private business owner, is without question the biggest challenge that I face. Every single day is being in the present moment. Now the short definition of being in the present moment is be where your feet are. Wherever your feet are, make sure that's where your head and your heart are as well. And this is absolutely crucial to creating the connections that we've already established we need to be able to achieve that North Star. If you want to strengthen the connections with the people in this room, you want to strengthen the connections with the people you serve, or you want to strengthen the connection with anyone in your life, significant other, children, neighbor, it doesn't matter. The very first step to doing that is being in the present moment. Now, I've done this long enough to know, especially with an audience of 300, I don't know what the actual percentage is. I could make something up on the spot. Not every single person in this room right now is fully present. Your feet are in the room, but there's some of you right now, your head and your heart are not in this room. You're staring at your phone or you're thinking of something other than what's transpiring right now. And I don't say that with judgment, and I certainly don't take any offense to it. I just know for a fact that attention is the number one currency we have. It's the number one gift you can give another human being is your attention in the present moment. It's the number one gift you have to give. And that's because time is our most precious resource. The moment each of us were born, an hourglass got flipped over and sand started falling. And in 43 years of walking this earth, I've figured out there are three indisputable truths about time. And there are three indisputable truths about that hourglass. Number one, none of us has any idea how much sand is at the top. None of us do. Tomorrow's not promised. Tomorrow's not guaranteed. Number two, we can't stop the sand from falling to the bottom. You can't pause time. You can't stop time. And number three, once the sand hits the bottom, it's gone, and it's gone forever. You can't get time back, and you can't relive time. Now, you can learn from the past, and if you're wise, you will learn from the past, but you can't relive it. And because time is our most precious resource, then that means our attention in the present moment is without question the greatest gift we can give to someone else. Now, we talked earlier about you're always communicating something. If you give someone your full undivided attention, you are unconsciously telling them that you are important to me, that I care about you, that what you have to say is something that I value. And there is no greater glue in the world to forge a relationship or a connection than that. 